Well, I'm here today because it's one more day that we have to talk about the issue of domestic violence, educate people, and be a voice for the victims. And maybe by them seeing on the news tonight that there are resources for them and that there are people that want to help them, maybe we can get one more person to leave a bad situation. Intervention is what happens every day under PCADV and the member organizations. 90,000 individuals are served each year, directly served through the work done by PCADV and its members. PCADV serves a huge purpose in educating the 203 members of the House and the 50 senators to this issue. So their advocacy and bringing advocates as they did today to the Capitol to talk to senators, to talk to House members, to talk to their staff about this issue and also about the bills we have currently, not law, but we're trying to move through the system to help with domestic violence issues. I think that having Domestic Violence Awareness Month is very important because, again, it goes back to educating. So the more we talk about it, the more it can come out from behind closed doors. Because many times it's not just one person. It's a child. It's a mother. It's, it's someone that we need to protect. And there are ways we can do it. Law enforcement is ready to help. There are advocates ready to help. And we need to be that voice and educate. So the more we talk about it, the more hopefully a victim will hear it and get help. Pennsylvanians need to understand what an epidemic this is and also to be able to know the signs of domestic violence because often it remains hitting. People are ashamed or they're embarrassed and they're, or they're, they're afraid to say anything. And we're hopeful as we get the word out that the people can notice that there's something wrong in this situation and in, 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 in doing that save lives. We're here today to celebrate survivors and also to honor and mourn those victims who lost their lives to domestic violence this past year. PCADV is crucial to getting the message out as we move bills through Harrisburg. They're the education arm that comes up here and educates the 203 members of the House, the 50 members of the Senate, and more, just as importantly, their staff on the legislation that we're currently looking to enact to make life safer for victims of domestic violence. No one should lose their life or have to suffer abuse as a result of domestic violence. And it's in the memory of those we've lost and in honor of those who have survived that I dedicate my work at PCADV. Thank you.